Hi guys, today I'll be showing you one of the best clipboard manager app that fully supports macOS Big Sur. This app is called Oka Paste here. And you may not see anything here, but it's actually on this side here. You just put it at the side of your screen and they even have the icon at the menu bar. So what this app does is that it allows you to record all contents that you have copied and store the links to those copied contents into various categories for easy access. You can download this app directly from App Store and you type in Oka Paste. Enter. It's right here. So you can do a lot of things with this app. We'll go into the detail of this app soon, but let's scroll down and see what's at the bottom here. So the in-app purchases, if you're a free user, if you click on VIP benefits here, free user, you can only use the basic functions, copy and paste, and it may store a number of copied contents, but it won't store a lot. Unlike the VIP user, they may have unlimited copy actions. You can compare the difference between free and VIP user here. You can even subscribe to a yearly auto renew VIP subscription. But if you love this app, I would recommend you to choose the lifetime VIP because you only pay $10 one time and you're good to go. You don't have to pay $5 every year. Right, so let me show you how this app works. Why is it one of the best clipboard manager app? So the app is on this side. It just categorized into different sections here. So let's copy something. I mean, usually with the built-in copy and paste feature, for example, like let's say you want to copy these three words. You copy. After you copy it, you can only record this one content that you copy before you paste it. But if you copy a new content, the old content will be replaced. It won't store your old content. And also, unlike other clipboard manager apps, Oka Paste allows you to do more with the contents that you have copied. So at the moment, I just copy that words and you'll see there text right here. These are the words we copy at the moment. It knows by itself what kind of content it is. If it is a text, they put it into the text category. If it is a link, they put it into the link. If it is image, it would put here. File, notes, and other. Let me copy, let's say, a photo here. Copy. And it may store in here as well. Image. Here. And the great thing about this app is that it allows you to view it as well. If you click on it, you can even view it first. And if you decide to copy it, there's two ways to copy. You can either right click and select copy to pasteboard, like so, or you just double click on it. It also copied. And then you can paste anywhere you want. Let's say I want to paste it into a new folder. Right click and paste. See here. So no matter where the content is, you go somewhere inside folders or folders. But then when you click copy, it, it will remember that and save it up here so that you can paste it anytime you want. Let's say I have a movie here. Just copy. Then it will remember it. If you click on file, there's a movie. Click there. You can even view that movie. Click play here. See? So that's the movie. You can even just access all of them by clicking all here, all section. Everything that you have copied earlier will be there. Or you can just go to different categories of it. It's really cool. Even the music, anything that you copy, it will remember. Just copy and it will be there. Click all here. That's the music. Again, you can even preview it first. Again, any kind of contents, you can just copy and it will remember. Right there. So let's say we have another file inside folders of folders. Let's go to documents here. Ringtone. Let's say this one here. So I just copy it. See, it pop up here. So in case you, let's say you copy this first, you want to paste it to this folder. But then the next one, you want to copy this ringtone here. Just double click on it and paste. It's really cool. And again, it's still stored here. It won't remove it until you decide to do so. You can click the cross icon here to remove it from there. And let's try with the links. Let's go to YouTube. Again, like I said, you can copy anything and it will store and remember it for you. And you can just come here and get access to those links or contents easily. So we go to YouTube here. So let's say I want to view this video here. And then I want to copy the link here. Let me take a look at all here. We can even view the video. Right here, you can see. It's really cool. 
any content that is playable it will allow you to view as well also if it is a file like this pdf file like for example here you can just copy it and if you view it click all here click on it you can see and you can even scroll down to the bottom to see what's in there so it's like you just view the whole thing without having to open it just copy it and you can view it it's really cool you can even add more section more category to it but this feature only available for the vip user if you want to add more categories to it you choose one here let's say music it's saved and then it will be there this will stay here no matter where you go what app you're into it's still stuck there so that you can access it easily but if you find this intrusive you can also hide them by going to its preferences up here the icon click on preferences so we just go to appearance here and then you see this option here say auto high color bar and then delay three seconds so you just tick here three seconds see disappear but when you scroll your cursor to it it will pop back up see so it won't be intrusive anymore and for general here you can set it to launch at startup that's what i would recommend you to do click launch at startup here so that whenever you turn on your computer your ochre paste will always be there to store the content that you have copied okay that's it guys this is the ochre paste clipboard manager app for macOS Big Sur. thank you so much for watching if you like the video please give us a thumbs up comment down below and subscribe for more useful videos in the future have a great day guys see you in the next video